Welcome back everyone. Okay, so here we go. I got the fully built Ninja ZX-10R, and I mean fully. It's got all the upgrades. Oh my gosh. So the numbers on this thing. 219 horsepower, 171 torque, uh, everything. Oh, the weight went down like crazy. Um, look at those numbers on the sides. Okay, so this is what it looks like here. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I, after I did the, cil the cylinder thing, the full Krakovic, uh, race wheels, new cha new every, literally every part has been, that can possibly be replaced in the demo, is replaced. Um, yeah, it's nuts. This thing is so freaking fast. I did a few races beforehand just to see what it was like as I was building it, and oh my god, it is so ridiculous. Um, it's really awesome the sense of speed you get from this thing. This thing is just nuts. I mean, okay. It's what, 219, I think, as I recall? Yeah, 219 horsepower. That's insane. It is so insane. Like, oh my gosh. That is on its way to being a MotoGP bike. Um, it could probably compete with the race bike in this game, I'm sure, at this point, because it's like been rebuilt so hardcore. So we're going to try it on with racing with realistic opponents. Um, I beat hard. I walked him by like six seconds. Look at this thing. Yeah, what do you think? <laughs> I think it did a pretty good job styling-wise. Like, I love the, the black and the green, the white. It looks really cool. It looks like a ninja, you know? It looks like a Kawasaki ninja. Oh, and the crop fish looks freaking sweet. Oh, my God. Bike aesthetics. And I went with the gold um, forks because I thought that looked really cool, you know, kind of to offset everything. And uh, this bike is ridiculous. Uh, let's go drive it. I got the the wheels are very different. There's uh, different kinds. There's a lot of different types. And certain the ones I got are the lightest. They are the lightest wheels. Uh, <laughs> so everything on this bike has just been basically redone. Okay, yeah, difficult. Realistic. There we go. They've been set. Now what's cool is once you finally get the gear and the suspension thing, you can change everything. Um, I'm not going to mess with those, but I did mess with the suspension earlier, because why not? So I'll make it as responsive as possible. Um, there we go. Super responsive. Okay, here we go. The Beast ZX-10 run. Oh my gosh, this thing is balling. I, a few races before it was fully upgraded. <laughs> Look at that hop. Um, a few races before it was upgraded, I walked people at the starting line. That's how ridiculous this thing is. I dare not put the traction control off, though. Look at this. Oh, it looks so good. Look at it go. Oh my gosh. Oh, I messed that up. This, the quick shifter makes a huge difference too. Oh. Get out of my way. Alright, I'll try to go for just time here. Look, that's realistic opponents. <laughs> I'm gone, I'm gone. Second corner and I'm gone. Uh oh. Oh, I messed up. I have to use a re. Oh no. I thought it was going to be a perfect run. Nope. Oh, here goes the front wheel. So I've been, I've been uh, mixing up the back and the front brake. It's better to just brake in a straight line with the rear brake and not even use the first. Okay, so this corner is tricky. Gotta go in full lean. You can full throttle it if you go full lean through it. There we go. 144 miles. Oh! I'm too far on the edge here. Okay, leg spike. Uh. Oh, what am I doing? That was sloppy. That was so sloppy. Okay, but watch how fast this thing gets up the speed. Oh, somebody's trying to catch me. That's interesting that Realistic AR are trying to catch me here. They might do that. I'm not doing too well on this lap. I got like a 1 minute 45 earlier, so we'll see what happens here. Arr, there we go. Just max this thing out. Oh my god, it's so fast. Uh, oh, failure yet again. We're going back to rewind. Okay. Whoa. 
Yeah, the frame rate, I turned off. Everything's on max except for V-Sync, which seemed to do the trick. Woohoo! When you full throttle through here, just leave it all the way over. <laughs> this thing is so fast. A little bit of break as that finish line comes up. Shoot it out. Past the finish line, 140. Woohoo! You can get up to 160 here. 167, not bad. Pop it down in the fourth. I'm not even using the whole track either, so like there's potential to go way faster. Oh, sliding. Ooh, okay, hit the wall. I usually don't do that. That was slow. That was slow. I can do that way better. This guy on me? Nope. Look at that. Look at that. This this bike is just so fast. I'm always tempted to lean it in earlier, but the braking. If you lean it, if you lean it in later, you slow down faster. Oh, I missed that one up. I could have gone way faster through that. Doesn't matter. See if they can catch me here. A little bit of front hop. Went wide on that turn. Okay. Punch it. Oh! Bike is so much fun. This bike is so much fun. Look at that. Like, this has all the upgrades possible, and I've actually tuned the suspension to my keyboardness. Which is basically just max twitchiness. And that will get it sweeping through these corners. Look at that. I'm using everything. Get back in the third, because I don't know what I'm doing. Okay. Usually this I just try to stay on the inside. 70. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Ooh. Lean it over. Tap the brake. Yeah, there we go. So fast, so freaking too fast. Let's see if I can wheelie it here. I can. <laughs> that was with the wheelie. Holy crap! Punch it through here. Try to go for it. Ooh, losing it. Ooh. No. Oh. That was awesome. The, that little run I had there going there with the sliding was awesome. Got a little too cocky. It's okay though. Oh, that slide was woo, hitting that wall. That slide was sweet. Get Kravovich, maybe, I guess it makes a big difference. Like it's, weight wise, this thing is as light as can be. So numbers, number, numbers wise, this thing is, holy crap, I bet it's probably one of the fastest bikes in the game. Oh, there we go, there's our front end. There's the front end going up. I mean, if you think about it, the ZX-10 is ridiculous. It, it has been since it came out. Put all the other bikes... Oh, dang it. See, you can't sleep on it. But, um... It put all the other Japanese horsepower bikes, like all their horsepower, to shame. Because it's just so fast. And I mean, 218 horses in this bad boy. That's so... F I mean... Look, I'm going 160 through Canyon, and then just sliding it through like every corner. This, this game, ride, okay, ride with a full worked bike is fun. I've been loving this. I have had no fun on that 600 Honda, which is surprising because I'm a Honda fanboy, but I've had no fun on it. None. The ZX-10, oh, I keep, oh my gosh, I'm just like getting, not paying attention, but the, the ZX-10. Fully works ZX10 is just so much fun. I love it. I love the way it feels, the way it runs. It sounds like a beast. It feels like a beast. It's predictable. Oh, so great! <sighs> but yeah, this I'm almost done here. Just wrapping up this final corner here. Just might as well go for it. Oh, right on that edge. Woo! Yes! Oh, he saved. He saved it. Okay, recommendation. Totally just upgrade the ZX10 as much as you can, because damn, damn, so fast. So unbelievably fast. That was awesome. Oh my gosh, I just want to do that again. I want to upgrade all these bikes. Oh, look at all of them. Oh, you can get them in the game, and then I can upgrade it. That was unrealistic, too, by the way. So, uh, hey, look, there's like crap on that bike. That's neat. Maybe they got hit. Okay, so maybe there is damage. But anyway, 
these must be all the they must just go through all the bikes at the end of the race but uh yeah that was unrealistic so i guess they like they're upgraded most of the ones at the front but probably not fully upgraded because look at the difference i'm on six seconds on the fastest guy compared to me so i doubt they're running 220 horsepower that's for sure because that was just i just kicked their butt in the first corner there was no competition so we'll see the next build i'll do is with the cbr which i'm sure is going to be a lot harder because i can only get third and i wasn't first on a fully stocked bike but i couldn't i couldn't do it i crashed and then it was too late but the one bike the two bikes i've been able to beat stock um for sure on medium was the uh triumph and the cx10 and then the ZX-10 on a realistic, oh my god, it's a blast. Gotta try it. So much fun. Uh, the next, like I said, the next thing I'll do is try the CBR 600, and we'll see how that goes.